What's up everyone, Cobra here. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we're back on Once Human, and I'm going to be showcasing what I think is possibly one of the best, if not the best weapon in the entire game, and it's not what you would expect. You'd think, oh, it's the gold scar or the gold AK. Actually, it's not. This weapon is the AWS Black Panther. It's the one I have right here. I do have a skin on it, so it doesn't actually look quite as cool as this, but it still looks pretty cool. So I'm going to be showing you this right here. So I'll actually go to my blueprints for you. This is it right here, the AWS 3 point, or 338 Black Panther. Now, what makes this so good is it already has 95% weak spot damage and 26% crit damage, but the ability, after aiming for 3 seconds, trigger Fortress Warfare with a 10 second cooldown. Attack increases the longer you aim, up to 30%, and after triggering it, gain 3 stacks of Brutal Mayhem and Weak Spot Damage plus 25%. Every shot reduces the effect by 1%. So, essentially, when you aim down your scope with this rifle, you get more and more damage the longer you aim down for with increased weak spot damage it does reduce a little bit every time you shoot but the starting damage and even the damage after that is so much more than you would get with any other weapon that it is totally worth it now i've even compared this i have the golden kam and the golden socr which respectively are the scar and the ak that's how they are. They're just named differently. And honestly, this one will deal way more damage way quicker. So I'm going to show you now where you're going to get this. You're going to come over here to this furnace layer. It is a level 32 recommended area. So I don't recommend this right off the bat. This is actually the fourth area you get to. So the enemies here are pretty tough if you are under leveled. But you can make it as long as you're, you know, 20s to 30s. Um, so we're going to want to come here right when you come in on this path, this big building right here, I'm going to put a little pin. That's where you're going to actually find it. So I'll show you right now. We're, we'll run up there. And I'll even show you the difference in, <coughs> in how the sniper works versus how like assault rifles and everything work. So you're going to come over here and you're going to come into this right here and you're going to hop up onto this here I always climb up onto these boxes right here and you're just going to jump right here so you get up here and then you can climb onto this ledge and the mysterious chest is going to be right here for you. If you get onto the roof, you can also fall through the holes in the roof onto these ledges. That works as well. But that's where you're going to get this blueprint right here. Which is what... Now, I have the Tier 4 version calibrated 3. So I'm going to show you how well that works. The massive amount of damage I can deal. But first, I want to show you how this works with a Tier 4 plus 7 calibrated gold KAM. So you can see, it kills them pretty fast. Deals 300 damage a hit, you know, up to 600 with a headshot. It works pretty well. But, the difference here is how much damage this will hit for. So we'll zoom in. You can see, now I have my full stacks. I just hit him for 10,000 damage. So we'll find someone else. Here's another one over here. You can see we'll zoom in. We'll get that full effect here. There's 9,700 damage. And this isn't getting a crit. This is your actual normal damage for a weak point shot. 8,000. So it does reduce every time like it says. But once you run out of that 3, it'll go back to the full here, I'll show you. This will be the fourth right here. He's going to come around this way. 
and there you go back over 10k now if you actually get a weak spot you can hit for over 12,000 this thing absolutely melts and the best part is how it works on elites it does I mean the same effect but when you have an elite enemy it is so much more effective than trying to shoot it with like five magazines of a machine gun you can drop it sometimes in less than five bullets so I'm gonna go ahead I'm gonna find an elite enemy for you guys and I'll cut to that in just one sec here okay guys so here we are and I've got an elite enemy right in front of me it's gonna be this right here Rosetta mechanic is you can see on my screen it says delete elite and defeat elite enemies I've already done it because I just killed one of these guys and here's another one so we're gonna charge this up right here and there's a level 38 elite enemy right here BAM one shot two shots and there's a Rosetta mechanic dead and that is considered an elite enemy and it was dropped in two shots. I'll see if I can find another one for you. Maybe one that has a little bit more health. Um, so you can get the full effect of it. Because not all of them will die in two hits. But it does deal absolutely massive amounts of damage. Okay guys. So here we are. Now I've got a real tough uh, elite enemy in front of me. Alright. So here we have a Rosetta Heavy. These are Rosetta Bruisers. These guys are known for having a ton of health <clears throat> sorry for the voice now we're gonna see how much we do on this ready and I missed 7,000 6,000 so it took three hits to take down a Rosetta Bruiser and then you saw those other elites were dropped in literally two hits so that's the kind of damage you're gonna be able to deal with this sniper rifle now there is another version of it um, this is the AWS, it's called the Bingo Frag. Now, this can only be earned from the Wish Machine. Um, to my knowledge, the only way is to exchange 8,000 Star Chrome for it. However, there may be an actual, um, way to win it in one of the spins at some point. But as of right now, it's just the 8,000 Star Chrome for this. And you can see the ability for this is a 70% chance to trigger the bullseye with a weak spot hit or after switching your weapon the first one will automatically be a bullseye and what its effect is is weak spot damage becomes 10% or 15% more for 10 seconds can stack up to three times so that's an extra 45% and after you defeat an enemy with a weak spot attack attack plus 15% for 20 seconds so basically you get increased weak spot damage and a little bit more attack once you kill something, which also can get pretty high. However, I personally think that this one has uh, a potential to get a lot more damage. So that's why I'm sticking with the AWS Black Panther. Now I hope this uh, video was informational for you. If you have any questions, let me know. I'm always happy to answer for you guys. But that is my recommendation for one of the best weapons, if not the actual best weapon in the entire game. You just watched me take out elites with it. I've used it against bosses. I've used it against normal enemies. It got me through areas where I was actually not supposed to be in because I could just headshot, one-shot kill the people that were like eight levels above me, sometimes more because this thing is so strong. So I hope this is helpful, guys. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Uh, the more support I get, the more videos I will continue to make. And please let me know if there's any other videos you would like me to do. I'm always happy to take requests on that. And I will see you guys next time.